Hello everyone, how are we doing? Good to have you, good to have you. Welcome to today's video. And in this video, we're going to be doing an analysis of gold and what to expect from the market this week. Today is 28 November. Now, for those who have been following our channel, I want to believe you've been able to make some good profits. I want to say congratulations. I want to say kudos. Last week, gold was at about this region. Yeah, this region, I think, here. And we say that gold is going bearish. And we say that gold is going bearish until it gets to this point. This was our TP 1800.98. And gold did exactly that. If you can remember vividly, we said gold is going to sell till it comes in contact with the 10 day simple moving average on the weekly time frame. Then it's going to hold on and perhaps um, we are going to start expecting a bullish move from there. And that's exactly what happened. So gold sold very hard, very hard yesterday. And that happened on Monday. Monday where um, there was a fundamental news where Joe Biden nominated, um, what's his name? Jerome Powell to be the Fed Reserve chairman for another four years so the market went bearish so because many people have um, hope on um, Jerome Powell believing that it's going to give or it's going to make the United States dollar have a better strength or it's going to boost the economy so many people betted for the dollar and dollar gained strength then gold sold real hard on Monday so that's exactly what happened within last week and it sold again on Tuesday, then Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, or oh, Wednesday, Thursday, it lingered around here and Friday there was a little bullish move. Then um, there was another move by I think 6 p.m. on Friday, yeah Friday, then there was this bearish move. So what do we expect from the market this week? That's what this video is about. Firstly, um, let's see the four hours time frame. Four hours. Okay, let me take these off because we achieved these. Alright, so that's been done. Let's see what is happening on the four hours time frame. So on the four hours, we can see that the market ended with a bullish arami. A bullish arami. Remember, we said that when gold comes in contact with okay, let's start from here or let's go to daily time frame. Let me explain this. We said that gold is already is actually in um an uptrend which is in an uptrend and like we know or like some people used to say gold goes up using the stairs and come down using the elevator so we could see gold move from here to here it was um up down up down up down up down so it's like moving in a stairs but the movement from here to this region was quite drastic what you may want to call moving using the elevator so after this done remember well, like we said gold is in the uptrend in the long term so we're expecting gold to go bullish again to go bullish again that's what we're expecting since it has come in contact with the 10 day simple moving average on the weekly time frame so that retracement is over I believe the retracement is over so we should be looking for an entry on the an entry in the lower time frame perhaps the four hours time frame and take a buy so um 
although it could linger again here there are chances that it could spend maybe a day or two here again but we're looking forward this week we're looking forward to gold going bullish and this time it's going to cross this region it's coming to this region which is um Nineteen o seven. Nineteen o seven. So we're expecting gold to come to that region. Since in the last move it broke this region, which was eighteen thirty, which held it for quite a while. Gold was held within this region for quite a while. So now this range has been broken. It has been broken and it got up here. Then there is a. Uh, a retracement or let's call it a retest back to this region it has retest, retested back to this region so we are now looking forward to another break another break or let's say the move to continue so um let's see where we expect gold or how far do we expect gold to go once this move kicks off so let's put use the Fibonacci tool and consider the higher high to the higher low. Number, or let's say these are TP1. It's coming here. And let me do this. These are TP1, 1868.12. Then TP2 is here, 1929.76, so that's TP2. So gold is coming that high. Gold is going that high. That's, that's our projection. That's our projection for gold this week that's what we're expecting from the gold market this week so we're expecting gold to go bullish firstly it's coming back to um this high where the retracement happened then it's going to go higher than that and okay that's of course on daily time frame we've seen that on the weekly time frame we said that it's going um after coming in contact with the 10 day simple moving average on the weekly time frame which we saw that happen it's going bullish again so what i want us to do is look for or wait for a good entry on the lesser time frame perhaps daily or four hours time frame wait for a good entry signal then take advantage of it and go all in so we're expecting gold to go that high that's our projection for the gold market this week if you have a different opinion do well to use the comment section and of course make your comment respectfully we'll be very glad to have a conversation with you then like we always say the forex market is a highly risky endeavor you don't want to venture into the forex market without a proper training so if you don't have a proper training avoid the forex market all you should do is perhaps watch videos learn until you're able to start trading and perhaps you may want to practice on demo if you want to take a complete training with us you can reach us through our website www.noahenterprise.com or you could reach us through any of our social media handles you can find that in the description of this video if you want to subscribe for our signal you can also reach us through um, our social media handles you want to sign up for our copy trading service you can also reach us through our social media handles copy trading is a is a mode of trading where you don't need to know how to trade all you need to do is create an account and link it to a master traders account where the pros are trading so if you want to link your trading account to our trading account send us a message that you're interested in copy trading and we're going to direct you on how to link your account with ours and as we trade 
it's automatically reflected to your account and you're going to make profit alongside so that's it any question use the comment section if you're not yet subscribed to this channel you know you should do that you like this video give us a thumbs up then you like what we're doing on this channel subscribe click on the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell so that each time we release videos like this you'll be notified and you can come watch the videos so that's all for today's video thanks for your time see you in our next video bye for now